Welcome brothers and sisters, welcome to a new video of Triple Gris. My name is Michael, I'm the founder of Triple Gris and the Righteous Path Movement Foundation. And the topic of this video is Stand Ready. It is time. Brothers and sisters, let us have a look at June and at the dates that are so important for us, that are at our heart, our mind and our soul for this month, that we are looking forward. First will be the 6th of June. This is a day when the Lord will be seen on the horizon. This is a day when he will come for the brides and for the little ones that are selected for this moment in time. You need to understand, brothers and sisters, that not all children will go. But the Lord will have selected a certain one for his glory, for the glory of the kingdom, so that the world can see his power and his might. The 6th of June will be when the brides will see the bridegroom on the horizon. And then on the 8th to 9th, I expect the first praise reports to come in from the brides and or the little ones. There might be videos coming up that they have met the Lord, that they have abide in him and he in them and that he have given them promises or whatever you will see that will be an important time also 8th and 9th of june then brothers and sisters very important day is the opening of the portal and the flash of light that will then transform us make us ready for our destiny and purpose here on earth and that will be on the 11th of june 2022 yes you heard me right the opening of the portal and the flash of light will come on the 11th of june 2022 followed rapidly by a calling forth of the first apostles and disciples then entering into a whole new world. And then on the 14th, the wedding week will start. The 14th of June, brothers and sisters, the wedding week will start. One week, going to the 21st of June. Why is this wedding week important? Because it's a fulfillment. The fulfillment, what you have learned and was, was revealed to you, in the video about Laban and Jacob. It is a wedding of Leah, not Rachel. The wedding of Leah, seven days, the week must be fulfilled. And then, on the 21st of June, 2022, will be the escape of the innocent. Millions of people will vanish from this earth. Are you ready? Stand ready. It is time, brothers and sisters. It is time. So you will ask, when will the 40 days start? There we have two options. It could start on the 14th if it includes the wedding week, or it would start then on the 24th after the escape of the innocent. Two possibilities, the 14th or the 24th. I believe in the moment that it would start on the 14th of June. 40 days, 10 days to the 50th day, and then the harvest workers and the harvest will begin. Because then also the volunteered Leahbright will have received all knowledge and wisdom and are ready to have received the Holy Spirit and are ready to enter their destiny and purpose. You see, these are all patterns, brothers and sisters. All patterns. There is a flash of light that is the time of resurrection, just before the 40 days of Jesus in his first coming. That is the flash of light and the opening of the portal. Do you think there was not an opening of the portal when Jesus was resurrected in the first place? Of course. The mighty hand of the Father was seen to resurrect his Son on the earth. That was a flash of light. I will talk about it in another video today. 
and then the 40 days begins, but not right away. First, in the first meeting, who will meet first? The brides. That's the symbol of Mary Magdalene at, the, at Magdala or Magdalene, whatever you call it, at the gravesite. That is a symbol for the bride. And then he meets two people, right, on the road to Emmaus. And what are these two people representing? The called forth apostles and disciples, the ones that most likely, I believe, will go into the circular time, who get the spirit breast on them, not have to wait for the 50th day. And then what happened in the pattern? Then there's a break. A break of what? Around a week. A week's break. So the pattern are all there. The week's break is a wedding week in, in the end times. It is all there. Brothers and sisters, six, eight, nine, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, twenty-one, and maybe twenty-four. These are the important days in this month. Stand ready. It is time, brothers and sisters. It is time. Oh, I'm looking so forward to the eleventh. To the eleventh of the outpouring of the flesh the flash of light, looking forward to it. And I hope that everything will then be done, that everything will be reset, and that we have use and strength and power to enter our final race to run. Brothers and sisters, it's time to come together. It is time to speak forth the truth, the truth that was revealed over the last seven years. It is time to stand in unity and in love and in support together. We must be now a band of brothers and sisters on the battlefields. Have you put on your full armor? Have you put on your helmet of salvation and do you hold the sword of the Spirit in your hand? But also have you clothed yourself in fine white linen as a ready-made bride, ready to meet the bridegroom? He is coming. The 6th of June will be the time when the first brides will see him on the horizon and beat him. 11 the flesh. Then 14, 40 days will start most likely from the 14th. Then the wedding week. Then on the 21st the escape of the innocent. Wow, brothers and sisters. Then Jesus will stand, be standing in Jerusalem. The world will reject him but we will be the witnesses for him. No matter if we go in circular or linear time, because the ones who go in circular time will also be, be able to operate at the same time in linear time. Because he has a foundation layer. Very important position. The Church of Ephesus. It must be done. Safe havens must be built in the world in linear and in circular time. The harvest must be protected once it's gathered. What... what Use would it be if you make a lot of effort, two and a half years of harvest, you store them all together, and then thieves and robbers will come and take it all away. That will not happen with the Father. It won't. Therefore, we are building the safe haven to store, to store the harvest of the Lord so that they can reach safely. Mount Zion at the sixth seal for the rapture into the into paradise. It's time to stand, brothers and sisters. We are so close. Four days for the Lord to appear on the horizon. Oh, then the press reports. And then the eleventh, this glorious day, when everything will change. The wedding week, the escape of the innocent, and then you're already. Walking with the Lord, the lay brides who have volunteered will already walk with the Lord to receive knowledge and wisdom. All patterns to the first 40 days. It's all beginning right now. This is our month. And I'm telling you, as a warrior for in the remnant army of New Zion, the warrior for the Lord, I am ready. I am ready to enter my destiny, and I am so eager. My soul is yearning or the puppets here on earth. And I'm so ready to build this safe haven and everything what belongs to it, so that I can serve him. Serve him as never before. 
serve him as a true son as Jesus has done before me. Please, Lord, allow all of us as a powerful warriors to walk as the images of our Lord and Savior and Bridegroom here on earth in this moment of time. So that we can fulfill all that you have selected for us. That we are predestined from right from paradise, from where we came. That all the promises we gave you at that time will be fulfilled now. We love you, Father. We love you, Father, so much. Now, allow us to serve you in the holy places. Brothers and sisters, stand ready. It is time. Be blessed in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen and Amen. Maranath.